Hello and welcome to day 16. I am currently on the downhill slope of a 30 day clean eating challenge and I am really excited to see this thing through to the end of the 30 days and frankly to keep going with it after that. I am feeling better after just two weeks, a little over two weeks on this little challenge that I'm doing. I am feeling significantly better in those two weeks than I have in a very long time. And not only that, I am losing weight. My clothes are getting looser and just generally overall, I feel so good. And so I am very excited to keep going with this and to see where this lifestyle change can take me because for the first time in a very, very long time, years and years, I am feeling like I have found a really good fit for a new lifestyle change for me and a new healthier life. So I am ready to keep going with that. This morning as I was rolling out of bed at six o'clock and when I was feeling like, oh, I just don't wanna get up, I don't wanna face another day, I don't wanna come out here and do a workout, I just wanna throw the covers over my head and sleep in and not, not face that daily grind for another day. But I was thinking about how important it has been for me to get up early like that every day, to make that choice, to do that hard thing that I don't wanna do every day because I know that it's making me a better person. I know that taking those couple of hours first thing early in the morning is super important to fill my cup, to take care of me, to take that time to do things for me that help me feel good, that help me um, feel healthy, that give me energy and help me be a better person, a happier person, a better mom and a better wife and all of those things that I really want to get better at. And so taking that action every single day to wake up early when I don't want to and I really don't need to has been really important to um, helping me make the changes in my life that I need to make. And as I was thinking about how important it is to take those actions, to actually do that hard work, um, I got to writing in my journal about it and I, I had a lot of thoughts and, and ideas about this coming to me that I wrote out in my journal that I wanna share with you guys. But first, I wanna talk about how important journaling has been for me. I have worked through a lot of junk, a lot of limiting beliefs, a lot of things that I struggle with that I haven't known what to do with. I have journaled about it and I don't always figure everything out through journaling, but it overall has helped me a lot over the years. Also, I write about things that I wanna remember, things I don't wanna forget that I'm learning. So I highly recommend journaling, if you've never tried it, to help you move forward in life, move forward towards your dreams and your goals and your aspirations. And as I was thinking of all this and writing about these things, and I was thinking how important it is to set goals, to dream about the life we want, to really like make a vision for the life that you want and the changes that you wanna make. And that's something I've done through journaling. Um, for a lot of years, but something that really stopped me up and helped and I was kind of holding me back and keeping me stuck was after I decided all those things and set goals and dreams and all those things, I didn't take action. I was afraid to take action. The action seemed too hard, so I stayed really stuck. And I'm learning right now, these last few months, that I am not gonna get anywhere near my goals and near my dreams and near the life I want if I do not take the actions to get there. And so I wanted to share with you all what I wrote in my journal today because it turned out to be very profound and I'm wondering where it came from. It was in my head somewhere and I'm glad it came out because I enjoyed writing it and it's something I will go back to and remember because I don't wanna forget these thoughts that I was having today. So I'm glad that I um, wrote it down in my journal, but I wanna share it with you guys right now. And I call this journal entry, Taking Action. To make major change in one's life, it takes deliberate, relentless action every single day. It requires hard work every single day. It requires that when the going gets tough, and it will, that I dig in my heels and get tougher and work harder. That's how change happens. That's how we learn. That's how we grow. These are the very best circumstances for real, true, lasting, and positive change. It's not meant to be comfortable. It's not meant to be easy, so quit waiting for that to happen. If I do not accept these truths, I will stay stuck, period. 
This change requires that I work hard when I do not want to, especially when I do not want to. If there is something I know I need to do but don't want to do it, it's all the more important to do that thing anyway. Change is not for the faint of heart. It is not the easy path. It is the harder path, the rocky path, the muddy path, the path with sheer cliffs on either side at times. It is the path that puts up a knockdown, drag out fight up the side of the steepest mountain. This path will test you every single day, period. And that, that is where we find out we are more than capable, more than worthy, more than deserving because we had to fight for every single inch of progress. And that is the real gift, learning that yes, I can do it. It just takes deliberate, relentless action disguised as hard work every single day. And with that being said, let's get to the workout that I really don't want to do today. <laughs>